Hey mate, the saga continues. We're playing with this, and what this problem with this um saw was with me gasket. The exhaust gasket, um, fuel there. It's slightly smaller than the gasket. That's why I like it. A little, a little bit small, not dumb. You have a larger, you it's small into a large muffler. Where's the muffler? You want somebody here? Put on the floor. Oh! You know what? Here it goes. But you know him, the muffler's underneath this car. So, the hole's slightly smaller than what the muffler hole is, so, if you look at that gasket, it's on the holes, pretty well right. So, port matching. Before it was hanging right inside of that, so, it was restricted as much, yeah, like, it was alright, but it's not as good as it could be. If you look at the muffler here, it's perfect size, so I made that bigger. I've had more time in the, in the exhaust, so I opened that up a bit. It's all dirty now. I clean it. Don't know numbers yet, but the actual exhaust is smaller than an XP, which I find quite weird. So that was on 100 degrees at the time. It's probably now 97, 96, something like that. But um, it's smaller. It's weird. So, if you want to go further, you could go further, um, quite easily really, but um, that's what it was, I'll do with that timing. Now I have um, dropped the side skirts here just a tiny bit, I'd say half a mil, both sides. Let's do the piston, if you look at the piston, you see what I mean, with the um, way the gates open on the piston sides there. But um, I've opened the, um, the upper transfers just up here too, so both sides, I've more of an angled edge there. So a bit of flow, I suppose. Um, it should be good, right? Good now, I suppose. That's all it was, really. Um, yeah, I'm so happy with that now. But it just exhaust. It couldn't breathe, so that was the reason it couldn't rev. So I'll clean it all up and I'll put in the saw and see how tiny it is. But yeah, it couldn't breathe. That's all it was. I'm gonna clean the part. Okay, the one thing I should point out. I just washed this um, but I'll get that tool. Uh, maybe yeah. Now this tool, uh, why not? This tool here is a um, long burr that goes down there now all the way. Try and top that up a bit. So it wouldn't go all the way down before because what happens, we try and do stuff like this, you snap your, um, your drum with the tool. It, like the cable going here will snap. You're very careful pushing these down, they're very tight. You can see uh, the one there first. Tight going down there when one side would go down just easy enough I could do it and but the other side wouldn't go down now I can so I took my time doing this I spent a lot of time last time playing around with this getting more and more but just it's pain now it's not much metal here but um I can do it now um we got rid of all the little hiccups hiccups hurdles angle that down so it's better, better flow way better flow that should go good Put the tool back up. Back in the hole. Uh, the exhaust now has been washed and blown out. I've washed it up now, so I've washed it really hit something. Just wet and dirty. That's clean. Bit of crap, crap and stuff still in there. But what's the numbers? I'll get the saw over here, wipe that out with um, a bit of paper towel. Um, some cotton buds, but they're going there. Um, yeah, I think it's papers out. But that now is a lot bigger than what it was. Wider, it flows better. So that will work a hell of a lot better. But I can still go wider if I want to. It's just one of those things, guys. Um, uh, really, they could have gone wider. They really could have. But um, they didn't do it. Um, and that's what the problem is. So I should mention that against a 372. So it's still crap down there. I'll blow that out, so. But then there's bits of metal and stuff. But yeah, nice and clean. Yeah, metal down there. So I'll clean it up, I'll get the saw, and we'll bottle on and see, see what the numbers turn out to be. Alright, do that. Well, I'm curious myself now what this thing is. I'll make sure it's zeroed in. There's my um, piston stuffer. There she is. The two bolts um, screwed down. This is nothing but Bob, it's, uh, it should have moved, but make sure she's in. Winding quite a bit to take an uh, accurate um, measurement. Pretty pissy stuff. 
So, it should be around 40, I think. At 47. Forty-seven, so she's zeroed in still. Make sure it is right. Nipped up. Well the um now so you know the transfers were 125, no base gets so, no base gas get sorry guys, I'm getting tired. Tied in the head. So go up and going up. Piston going up. Exhaust cracking open. I tidy up the um, intake too. The exhaust intake. And there we are, AC. That's good. Now, what's the exhaust still? I'll get that. The light at the front. It's where I'm interested. This thing going right up. Just start to go down now. Go down. Then we got a bit of port. That's light. Checking. So yeah, so I'm about 95. And that's the way I look at it. Um, you want first rate of light, it's a full rate of light, is there. That's full way. I don't do it like that. Because um, I can see light bleeding by, so it's already leaving the exhaust. So I'll go back to where it was. It was 100 before. And now we're looking at, I reckon 95 myself. 95, 96. Yeah, I'll go 95. So it was 100, now I'm 95. So it's your ample blood in. Uh, it's all to do with the width of the uh, port. And this is why, porting chainsaws, it's not a recipe that fits all the sizes. There's differences between saws and I reckon it will go now, we'll really go because we've got, we've got room to get the exhaust down. But there's a time also timing for that to get the exhaust down. But we'll have enough power still trapped between the piston and the cylinder. I have to see you at, um, yeah, it's way easy, guys. So I'll bottle this all down and we'll try it out hopefully next couple of days. All right, guys. That's what I've got that um, down there. Um, nothing else to do. No. But yeah. So, yeah, also, I put the um, transfers under water and Check the way they're flowing, and they flow really good. They flow back towards the intake where they should, but they also flow up, which is weird. I didn't see that before most saw, so she, she's quite designed well, but just the exhaust. The exhaust was no good. All right, guys, over now. Thanks for watching.